Hey everyone and welcome to the 17th Studio Vlog Cast Edition. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> it is the 2nd of November. How, how, how is it already November? This is absolutely freaking insane uh, this year. Even though with everything going on, I feel like has been going by extremely fast. If you are returning, thank you so much for coming back. I absolutely love your freaking faces, my adorable beans. And if you are a new, hello and welcome. My name is Candice or Candyware. And this is where you guys get to hang out with me in my art ventures and uh, just growing and learning about art and drawing and all that fun stuff. I also work full time in the animation industry on a Disney production as a lead layout artist. So if you guys ever have any animation or layout questions, definitely hit me up. I am so excited that this weekend went so well. My new vlog went up today, so the 16th vlog went up. And um, I was so nervous last week about being able to get all of my stickers printed, cut, and uh, the photo shoot being done. But I was able to get them all printed and cut on Saturday, and I did all of the photography yesterday, all of the editing of the photography also yesterday, and edited the vlog and got up all of my patron stuff for the, for the next month, so that has gone live on uh, Instagram. If you haven't checked it out already, this month on uh, my Patreon page, it's all about mushrooms, because I absolutely love mushrooms. I don't think we can be friends if you don't like mushrooms, okay? I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> but anyways, so um, I'm super excited about that, and... Um, also, this month's giveaway is now live, so definitely check out the description box down below or just type in candy with an I wear.com and you will get sent to my giveaway. And I just love giving back to the community because I know not everyone can support me on Patreon, so this is just my little cute way of giving back. I also, I say this every month. So, or every week I'm noticing this, but I've just been having a blast, an absolute blast working on my spreads, my weekly spreads, keeping me in, um, in order for all of my, uh, you know, things to do and whatnot. But I love my, my start, the spread for uh, the month of November. I also love what I decided to come up with for this month and this week, I should say. Um, I'm using some of my stickers again, and I also did a little print off for a little November wreath, which is really cute, and I've got my weekly goals. I'm trying to keep things really simple. Um, I'm also trying to remember to film some B-roll, because I'm really bad at filming B-roll for my studio vlogs, and I think that's really uh, keeping me from really hitting the next level of my studio vlogs. So I've got to do that. Um, then the other thing I wanted to show you guys that I finished is something that will be coming out later this week on Friday. This is going to be live for my patrons and look at this. I made this yesterday. Let me see if I can get this to focus. Yeah, there we go. So this is this coming month's wallpaper that is a Patreon exclusive. I am really, really excited about this. I was so nervous because I didn't know what to draw to begin with. And so um, I, I ended up seeing another YouTuber that I really like. One of her Inktobers, she ended up doing a little mushroom house. And I was like, wait a minute, that's the perfect idea. Why did I not think of doing a little mushroom house? So that inspired me to make my own version of a mushroom house and I like the fact that I I have a slightly different style than when it comes to making my sticker sheets. I'm wondering if something like this would be cool as a print. So you guys can let me know if this is something maybe in the future, maybe when I get a little bit better at, at doing these, if you guys would like these as prints. 
The other thing I need to think about this week is what I'm going to do for next month's theme. So obviously it's going to be Christmas. So I need to um, get inspired because I always love to have inspiration because I'm the type of person that personally works better when I have other things that give me inspiration. So I usually go on Pinterest and just start pinning a whole bunch of things or just save it to my um, my image roll just so that I have things to look back on. I used to get really hard on myself when I would use, you know, something for inspo, but at the end of the day, it helps me work on things better and everybody works from something, you know? So it's not like I'm ripping anyone off and tracing their work. I'm using what they have as inspiration to trigger what I think would be fun to do. So um, I always, I, I like to give that as an advice for people is when you have artist block or when you don't really know what to draw, find other things that inspire you to help you find some joy in what it is that you're drawing. So I hope you guys find that super helpful. So today I wanna get a workout in. Um, I also got, let me show you guys. I also got this cute little box. I decided it was time to upgrade. So these are baby wipe containers that I used to have. Um, I used to store all my minis in here and um, I wanted to repurpose it. And because I didn't have enough, um, enough stickers yet, I have like a little thing that kind of holds it from falling over. But I'm finding I'm wasting so much time doing these, these little dividers that I've decided that I need to upgrade and make something a little bit better than this. So we're going to be saying goodbye to the baby white box. Say goodbye everyone. And <laughs> I have invested in a box and it's a cute little box. Um, and, it, and what I like is these little inserts fit perfectly so they don't move around. The only um, problem I've noticed is that and I've, I did measure it, so I already kind of knew this ahead of time. So the main problem is that the stickers go above the little um, individual dividers. So I do have these little dividers that I ended up purchasing. And because these are so small, I can cut them in half and put them on. I'm also going to be labeling everything. Uh, for sticker sheets, it's going to be S-00 whatever. And then for my die cuts, it's going to be D dash zero zero whatever um and i'm gonna keep the sticker sheets in the front and die cuts in the back i think is a good way to do this because what i'm finding right now is i'm mixing everything all together just whatever i print off so you know it'll be like a couple die cuts a, a couple sticker sheets and what ends up happening is they all just kind of go one after the other instead of actually keeping them apart and I'm not really liking my um, my way of organizing everything right now so I've got to get that all figured out. Another fun thing, I mean it kind of sucks that this happened, I was having a lot of issues on the weekend with my die cut machine so I ended up pulling out the uh, the little cutter and trying to sharpen it up and also cleaning my mat board So I had a lot of issues this past weekend with trying to get it to cut right One, the pressure wasn't enough or it was too much and then it wasn't sticking I've been finding for the last couple of weeks So I tried a different setting and it was way too strong on my sticker sheets to the point where it cut out my stickers I'm so sad it cut out all of my little stickers so what that means is I've got a ton of these that are going to either be freebies or I'm going to be um, putting these on the outside of your orders, of your Etsy orders. So that's what is going to happen with these little guys. So they're going to find a good home because I don't see the point in throwing these out. And this is a repurposed cup from... Uh, I used to have a plant that lived in here, but it died. Um, I have a problem with keeping plants alive, FYI. Uh, <laughs> so there's that as well. It, it was kind of turmoil in, in the thick of it, but um, I, at least I'm trying to make use of, of something that 
was a bad situation into something good. But I have so much to do tonight. I The intro was a bit long. Let's go and walk a puppy. Uh, I need to do some yoga. I want to get all of my sticker sheets in order, at least the sheets. I've got to order more of the dividers to come in, which are going to be coming in tomorrow, and then I can at least do all of my die cuts tomorrow, and uh, label them all up, and hopefully if I can also get my, um, my update, my Etsy update ready to go live by the end of the week, then that's what's going to be happening then as well. Um, I think I'm planning on having my Etsy go live, my update, by the end of the week. I'm thinking come January though, I might take a break from doing an so Etsy like, update because I'm noticing my computer. Etsy is really slow. So, um, yeah. <laughs> and I'm finding that, you know, I've got to focus a lot more on my Patreon page anyways. So I think just for Christmas sake and for my sanity that come January I'm not going to have a update for my Etsy but only for Patreon. So there's that and I think I will do an end screen at the end of this. Actually let me add that. You know what? This is why I have my my planner page. Let me put in a note to myself on here. I like to use different colors for things. Um, maybe I'll do this tomorrow with my community when I'm streaming. So, um, and page for Patreon. Plus, oh, I'm also gonna do, so because my Patreon is quite small, which I still think you guys, I, I would be so happy even with one. Um, Patreon plus Twitch subs. So there's a lot of YouTubers that will go out of their way to thank their subs at the end of their videos. So I think that might be fun to do for my Patreon and my Twitch subs. So I will make that up. Um, I'll have to do some kind of little image of me in the middle. I have a hard time drawing myself as like a little chibi cartoon character. I'm never happy with it and I'm waiting for my uh, business cards to finish up so that I can uh, make new ones that look a little bit better because I'm constantly evolving with my art and I'm never satisfied. But tis the way of an artist. Am I not wrong? Alright guys, I've got a lot to do and I'm actually quite warm right now. Uh, but yeah, have yourselves a great Monday start to the week, and I will talk to you tomorrow. I love you guys. Goodbye. And welcome back it is Tuesday I had a lot of fun um, just reorganizing my space and cleaning my desk space because like I've mentioned in the past I spend a lot of time in this room considering my day job and all of that kind of stuff so I always find it really valuable to clean your space sometimes you just need a little bit of a break and I find you can come at things with a fresh eye when you have a clean space so I find it really valuable to do that kind of stuff. I also worked on a cute little drawing for my, um, I don't know if it's going to be like end page or something like that but it's definitely going to be a little section that I have on my YouTube videos. Hopefully I'll have it up for this one and uh, I might set it up tonight actually on stream saying thank you to my patrons and my subs on Twitch because, you know, I I think it's so awesome that you guys support me and it's just a little way for me to give back to you guys. 
So I did that yesterday while the hubby and I were watching some TV after dinner. And then another thing that I was able to finish today because I ended up getting a lot more of these cute little individual cards in the mail today. So I have sectioned off all of the work I've done since July. I can't believe how much I've done. Look at, look at, what's balance? I don't, I don't know what work-life balance is. Look at this. Look, look at this. How have I, how have I done this much? Uh, this is insane. So I have the beginning section as all of my sticker sheets. Ta-ta-da! And then it goes, so I, I decided I would use a numbering system so that I can go back and instead of doing whiteout and renaming everything, it's going to be easier to find things this way as well as I don't need to renumber this ever. If something is discontinued, then I can just take that out and put something new in its place and I don't have to worry about it. And then, so S stands for sheets and D stands for die cut. So this is where all of my die cut stickers live. And then I also have W for, for my washi tape samplers, which are right in the back. And then I just have this little divider or this little extra box here just because um, there is a little bit of space here and then all of my my little extra dividers as well as my little extra pieces of paper or little um, flags that I used because if I didn't use them um, my sticker sheets actually go up to the little box in the back so I needed something to be a little bit higher to prop it up but this is working out quite well it has some good weight to it I finished most of this yesterday I did all the all the numbering yesterday and then um, the, the dividers finished coming in today and I was able to finish this off today so I'm really happy with how this turned out and yeah so time to go walk puppy and have some dinner and then time to stream with you guys on Twitch. So if you guys want to hang out with me on Twitch, don't forget, or Discord, definitely check out all the links down below if you want to hang out with me after YouTube videos. But thank you so much for being here, guys, and I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Okay, Beans, goodbye. Hello, puppy. Hi, puppy. This is a this is our cute gem, Kerplopis. We have many names for this adorable bean, but she is the love of our life. I got her a new puppy bed because she's getting to be an old girl and I wanted her to have something cozy. But she's been bothering us a lot. There's the wine. Are you gonna whine again, puppy? What's that? Wine, wine. Of course, now that I'm filming her, she's not gonna whine. But um, yeah, she's been, she's been a little bit of a silly potato today. I don't know why. But she's gonna have to hold her horses until, um, oh, 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 look at this. We're breaking a puppy's heart. But um, yeah, we gotta do the podcast and then we'll take her out for a nice walk. Don't worry, we won't jip you tonight, puppy. Love you. Hey everyone and welcome back. It is Wednesday and yesterday I ended up taking the day off. Uh, I didn't end up streaming and I just wanna be real with you guys. So I felt good and then we ended up walking a puppy and having some dinner and I just, didn't really feel up to it. I felt, I'm just realizing that my camera, my tripod is a little bit lopsidey, but I didn't feel like I would be very happy streaming yesterday, so I ended up canceling stream. Um, and I didn't really feel like I had very much content that I wanted to showcase to the community, so I also canceled because of that. So. Um, there are just times that I don't really feel like streaming and I feel like it's happening more often than not, but I did make myself do a almost 40 minute workout, I think it was like 36 minute cardio workout, um, just because I told myself I had to do something. So I did that and I felt that I worked a lot on Monday that I did deserve a little bit of a break and I think that's important to remind yourself that that's okay. And uh, tonight, the puppy has been bothering us a lot lately, but we are going to do a podcast for my patrons and then 
Uh, we're gonna go walk a puppy, and I've got my online craft night. So I've got a Etsy order and the last month's giveaway winner package to get an order. So FYI, I did put some stipulations this time around because I'm still very new at doing giveaways monthly, but you need to respond within 24 hours or else I'll draw a new winner. And I gave this person, just because I hadn't given that stipulation the last time, I gave this person from the first until today, which is the fourth, and I still haven't heard back from them, so I decided I'd draw a new winner. But guys, don't forget to check out down below because every month I have a new giveaway at candyware.com, candy with an I as my name. And so I'd love it if you guys would take part and it's something, it's just a way for me to give back like I keep saying constantly to you guys. But okay, time for us to do a recording and I will check back with you guys in a little bit. Goodbye. Okay. Health to the end. Whew. Let's do this. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, let's, let me, let me, let me actually be good about this and, and see what podcast edition we're at. Mm. 14. All right, let's do this. 14. Jam, it's the 14th podcast. Hey everyone, and welcome to the 14th podcast edition of my patron podcast. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. I feel like you need a special sound effect when you, um, after that little wonderfully beautiful introduction but you dropped there. effort. No, I'm just joking. For sure. We need a <laughs> sound ridiculous. effect board. I don't have money for that. I mean, if somebody wants to buy me something like that, I'm totally down. But Interesting. I'm not, I'm not going to go out of my way to buy that. Okay. There's that thing that Marcel had, that little switchboard thingy, that I think you can do things like that on there. Yeah. But anyways, um, that thing looked fun. I digress. We digress. Today... This is, this is what happens when you get me on it right it's away. It's true, I it's digress true. quickly. Oh you my were God. saying today... Today we're going to be talking about the time change and sads and... <laughs> season changes. Season Speaking of sads, season did changes. you hear a doggo in the background? Yeah, she, she's, she's gonna want to walk any moment so we're, we're trying to get this down the pipe before we take a puppy for a walk before the puppy sads stick in it's true yes <laughs> <laughs> absolutely ridiculous all right all right guys 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 my update is here dun dun dun, dun. it is the beginning of the month which means I have some new stickers I know it's not a crazy amount to like the past couple of months but for my sanity I decided I would make it a little bit not as dying for me <laughs> so this time around I've got three or sorry four stickers well technically three sheets and one die cut stickers but I hope you guys really like them I'm as you can see I'm really digging the fall and I thought it was time for me to to do my love of tea so that's where all of these have come from and my patrons have decided, or sorry, my, my Twitch community has decided from this set here which ones should be die cuts. So that's how this was decided. I'm also really digging the way I had uh, taken all the photography. As you can see, I've got a couple new items um, that I'm using, like the twine and the star sprinkles and then these little jewels and things so I hope you guys really like the way that these turned out because I'm learning a lot more about photography than the way I used to take really boring pictures let me show you my boring pictures even these are not as good as as what I've been doing lately but um, I was always told that for minis you wanted to do them on a white background and look at how boring all of this is it's so boring so I'm, I'm really happy that I've, I've really varied everything up and um, I feel like I'm growing. Guys, I'm growing. This is very exciting. But anyways, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and I just wanted to come in and uh, say that. Okay. Bye, guys. I just wanted to give a big shout out to this month's supporters on Patreon and on Twitch. Thank you so much to every single one of you. You guys have no idea how much this means to me. And you guys help me keep doing the things that I'm doing and the dream that I'm living. Thank you so very much. I am so grateful every day. 
and I just wanted to showcase to you guys what um, setting up my Twitch stream is like and that's what I am doing in this footage right here. Um, and yeah, if you have gotten this far to in the video, definitely say a Twitch in the description box below and let me know what you guys thought of this week's vlog. I did it a little bit different if you can tell. There was a lot of admin and organizing that needed to be done and also um, I wanted to try some b-roll so I really hope you guys enjoyed all of this content and let me know what you thought in the description box below and I can't wait to talk to you guys further. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. I hope to hang out with you guys on my Twitch stream and if not in my Discord channel. So I hope to see you guys there. All right, have a good one and see you on the next one. Bye.